about a half hour ago, I went ahead and released Superlove 2.0. So hopefully everybody's able to go out now to the site and download that and begin using it immediately. Today, of course, we're going to uh, do a basic walkthrough of all of the features available within Super LOV 4, well, uh, 2.0, uh, which is actually for Apex 4.1. Uh, the release has been a long time coming. Frankly, I've been sitting on it for a while. Gary was kind enough to schedule this webinar, which of course forces me to actually do something rather than sit on it. So thanks to Gary for that one. Uh, also, I'd like to thank Jason Lyle. He's my partner in crime with this plugin. He's been working on it with me since day one and is responsible for quite a bit of what you'll be seeing here today in the new release. This is just a high-level overview of what we're going to be doing today. We're going to start with the basics, taking a look at how to install the plugin and, of course, get it working on a very basic level. Uh, from there, we're going to go into adjusting the look and feel of the, uh, the uh, plugin. There's quite a few different options for that, from jQuery UI themes to just various settings within the plugin itself. We'll look at those. And then we'll look at other, both global and instance-level settings, after which, we'll go into advanced features such as API methods and uh, additional and optional performance upgrades.